So I've always said that as real estate professionals that we lead with value. It's not about just touching doorknobs or allowing MLS to do the work for us in selling homes. So lead with data. What does that mean? Well, we again heard a very good uh, mortgage lender talk about this and break it down. And I think it's what we already know. Consumer sentiment, the money that's going out, you know, people planning vacations, they're spending more, they're living more, they're traveling more. Uh, when that goes down, inflation then goes down. Consumer price index goes down. That correlates. 10-year treasury, you can watch the numbers, lead with data. The numbers don't lie. You can go back 20 years and follow this. 10-year treasury, that goes down. What happens then? So the Federal Reserve Chairman, the most powerful man in the world, rates go down, right? Rates go down to try to spawn then more activity to get the economy going, okay? In reverse, just the same, right? So when this is going up, you're more likely then it's all going to then funnel upwards where inflation goes up. 10-year treasury, watch it. It'll go up and rates go up. Rates go up when they see uh, people are more confident their household economy. So really important things. So we're really careful when we talk about the rates, when the rates go down. That doesn't mean that it's immediate that the, you know, that the demand pool is just going to jump in and prices go up takes time.